らっしゃいませありがとうございました。ヤグミさん。
like a chan. Saison. Let's uh. Huh? <laughs> If I were to guess... Yeah. Hey! It's you?! Oh shit! Yagami! Hmm? Um... Nope. By the way, huh? in other words, don't mess with me.
Either way. Ah, who knows? Excuse me. that mean I see. It's all my fault. Seriously? I see.
So, this is Itokura-san's apartment. All right, Takanashi-san, we made it. There's the intercom. Okay. Who is it? Um, Kotoko? Can we talk? Uh, Micah? Is that you? What are you doing here? I came by because I wanted to apologize. <sighs> Just go home. Busy. Kotoko, come on. Can you at least hear me out for one minute? Just go away! Leave me alone! Itokura-san, just a moment. It's very important. This is Kyoko Amasawa from the Mystery Research Club, by the way. Amasawa? Mystery Club? What is this? Takanashi-san's been working as a sugar baby for you. She says she won't quit until you return to school. She's a what? For me? I don't understand what's going on. Itokura-san, we know that your scholarship's about to be revoked over your absenteeism. Takanashi-san has been working as a sugar baby in hopes of covering your tuition. What? Even though she's just been through a very scary experience, she still says she refuses to quit. <sighs> now, Kotoko... Hang on. What have you done? And why would you do something like that for me? Well, it's because I wasn't there for you when you needed me. Instead of being a friend, I practically sold you out to the committee. So you started selling yourself to cover a stranger's tuition? Uh, are you stupid? Why would you even think the school would accept your money? Why do you call yourself a stranger? You're my best friend! That... that that's not my point. I mean... Why would you go that far? <sighs> Hello? You gonna give me a reason or what? Kotoko... Do you remember when you first saw me dance in junior high? You said something I'll never forget, huh? I what? You told the shyest, most self-conscious girl on the planet exactly what she needed to hear to get her butt on stage. And it did the trick. I finally gained the courage to dance in front of an audience, and it was all because you had my back. If anyone makes fun of you up there, I'll knock their teeth right out. You told me that word for word. Well, that was just... You inspired me, Kotoko. You taught me what it was like to be brave and to have a friend. Yet, how did I repay you? I turned my back on you when you needed me the most. Even after you'd always been there for me. I was stupid. I was more concerned about looking good in front of the committee than sticking up for you. So, I left you to deal with your problems alone. I've been wanting to say, I'm sorry, but... I, I just couldn't find the words. Seriously. You waited all this time? Just go home. I'm never going back to that school. Hang on! Uh, Itokura-san. Hello. I'm Yagami, outside counselor for the MRC. Okay. So what? Do you think you could reconsider that last part? She's not gonna quit being a sugar baby until you're back at Serio. But we stop today, I don't think you want that kind of thing on your conscience. Well... I guess that would suck. If something happened, I'd hate to live with that for the rest of my life. But there's just no way. I can't deal with the assholes in my class anymore. Makes me sick just thinking about it. Is that a mystery you're reading? Are you a fan? Mm, 
Yeah, I guess so. And what of it? Maybe you'd be interested in joining the Mystery Research Club. Huh? If being around your classmates would be too much, you could start by just showing up to the MRC after school. That should make it easier to work your way up to attending classes again. As for the chairman, um, I'll take care of that. Mm. Now let's dial this back a bit. Why should anyone have to go to school anyway? It's an institution to educate the uneducated, and that's all. To get people into a state where maybe they'll be of use to society. School is fine for people who lack intelligence and initiative. I don't. So I certainly don't need it. Right. School isn't everything. I mean, I never graduated high school, and I've made my way through things just fine. See? Then what's the problem? Well, hanging around the school, becoming a counselor, it's made me realize something, actually. I'm realizing that I might have become an adult without... How should I put it? Getting to enjoy being a kid. Being a kid? Yeah. Both Amasawa and all the rabbits. They're living their lives to the fullest with their friends. It makes me wish I'd had something like that. Hmm. Itakura-san, why don't you just come check out the MRC? I wouldn't wish what I went through on anyone. If you come join us and still feel like dropping out afterwards, then I'll respect your decision and leave it at that. <sighs> well, if it's such a big deal to you, I guess I ought to consider it. And you'll come back? Only after school. And only to the MRC. On the condition that I keep my scholarship. Oh, you don't have to worry about that. Yagami-san will work it out. After all, he's a lawyer. All right, Kotoko. Then, I'll see you in school. Hmm. Hmm. Yes. By the way. Excuse me. Yeah. Yeah. Um...